Hello everybody, my craft is Ursa, and welcome to this episode of the Minus series. Today, taking a look at the 14W30B snapshot. And actually, it's A and B, I think. So, yeah, not only B. And, uh, yeah, the new things are banners. Kind of flags. So, yeah. And uh, I actually made an Estonian flag. So, yeah. Uh, basically, banners are completely, not completely, but kinda, completely customizable, uh, maybe like, painting paper sheets or something, so you kinda can paint on them, but not li like, not like directly that you place one down and then you like, take a brush and start painting, but in a crafting table, kinda like with, you know, fireworks, so I haven't prepared much, so I'll just show you some different patterns. Also, there's a link uh, down below in the description of the wiki, uh, Minecraft wiki banners, uh, with uh, all the different combinations and stuff what you can use. So I'll just uh, I don't know what. Okay, that's strange. Hmm. Yeah, I have to hold control while middle clicking. So you have to get the exact one. So if I just middle click on this one, I get the black one because it's made out of black. I started out with black, uh, but if I control click, then I get the one. So yeah. Anyways, uh, so let's start off with the white one. And what we'll do? So there are different patterns what you can apply of uh, different color. So for example, I don't know. Make another one stone, another stone flag. So just. I'll start off with the black one, the middle one, and uh, then I'll get some, uh, just a toy, I'll get some lapis, and I'll get some bone meal. So yeah, and now, uh, th there are different combinations, uh, some are even with uh, flowers or skulls or, I don't know, bricks, but uh, this is how to make a stone flag. So, uh, I start off with the black one, then I'll put three on top, I get the uh, top one, top stripe and now I put it on top in the graphing table and to the bottom and voila so yeah but uh, at first I tr when I tried to make an Estonian flag with the banners and uh, then actually uh, I started out with white I think and you can't make in the middle of uh, equally white or let's say high equally high um, on colored section like the other ones, it would be like uh, thinner. So yeah, that's because uh, that's why I have to start with the black banner. So yeah, basically you can also do like uh, don't know, take, let's take a white one and let's take uh, like red tie for example. Uh, you can if you don't want uh, like let's say you're playing on a multiplayer server. Uh, what has already the snapshot or it's one point eight whenever that comes out, uh, then you can make like this uh, kind of X, yeah, and then uh, like uh, you can put it on your door, so let's say uh, this is your house's door, uh, and then like that, uh, shift, right click, not just middle click, because not middle click, sorry, not just right click, and like that you can place it down and then you know, people will be like, oh, you don't want us to enter, okay, I'll go away, not enter, you know. So, yeah, that's a cool use for them. Uh, also, you can do stripes, you can do gradient. Uh, let me show what I like to do. I'll use the orange one. No, actually, let's use the yellow one. Let's make, like, no. Well, <laughs> I'm changing so much. Um, I'll use, uh, yeah, whatever, I'll just start out with a white one, I'll get some lime dye, then I'll get some, uh, some, oops, uh, some light blue dye, and uh, I'll get a, some yellow, and I'll, um, uh, where is it, uh, and uh, oxide, so, yeah. now, um, uh, let me think, how is it done? I don't have all the patterns stored in my head, let's say. Okay, this is how to make a gradient. Uh, I'm not sure if it works. No, it doesn't work the other way around, so you have to do it like that. Also, 
you can see this is an arrow. So yeah. Anyways, uh, I'll make a gradient. Then I'll uh, what else? I'll add some stripes like uh, this. Quite cool already. But now finally, I'll do this. So yeah, this is how to make something cool. I hope it's cool. But yeah, you can uh, just uh, in survival mode. By the way, the max stack size is uh, 16. So yeah, and in survival mode, you can just break it, pick it up, and use it again. So yeah. But actually, wait, what? Oh yeah, this stack together. For, s for some reason, a second do. A second ago, it didn't. So yeah, and also you can do skulls and stuff. Also, another update is uh, that's that doesn't have anything to do with the banners, uh, but uh, you can. Uh, let's see. If you get a skull, then with uh, oh, by the way, the skulls are now 3D models. If you hold them, so they hunt like items. So yeah, they look the same, but uh, I don't know the command by heart. But uh, if you give yourself or get uh, pretty much, I don't know how, but if you get a player head, then if the player has uh, like uh, uh, like a hat or something, I have uh, headphones. Uh, using the same layer thing, then basically if they have a second layer on the head, like a hat or or headphones or something like that, then it'll show up before it didn't show up. So yeah. But I uh, hope you enjoyed this episode of the mini series. And uh, wait, let me get an external flag. Also, by the way, with a command you can put the banners on your head. Uh, and if you hold them, they look really cool. So, hope you enjoyed this episode of Mine Series. Tune in the next one whenever it comes out. So, see you next time. Bye.